Hey Troop, Santo here from Iron Camp Fitness. Thank you for joining me. This is another client testimonials number four. This client testimonial is from Sandy. And I say this for every video, but if this is your first video watching with us, this is from a book that my wife Ray made me uh, when we had to set that, shut down the gym I had over the pandemic. And it was a really hard time for me. And uh, it was really hard even after, you know, getting myself together getting everything going again, getting everything back to my private location studio here at the Armory. It was really tough. And a lot of people wrote some great things. And my wife, she put it all in this book, all the photos we had of the person from uh, training sessions and kind of everything in the past she put together. So this is one of the most amazing books I've had. But because I felt so down on myself and I felt like a failure and I felt, um, you know, with the gym shutting down that I let everybody down, I couldn't take praise. And have you ever been in that situation where somebody tells you thank you and you don't accept it? That's how I felt that was. And that's that's not a good feeling. I don't like doing that to people. So now's my chance to accept praise. I've gotten a lot of help. I talk about this throughout a lot of videos about my mental health struggles through the military, PTSD, depression, ADHD, things that I've come through, things that I've gathered and things that I'm teaching now to go with the physical fitness and the strength conditioning coaching that I do. Now, I wanna talk a little bit today about self-care, guys. I think it's so important. It's definitely one aspect of improving ourselves that we gotta think about. And self-care is the, I, I, I think it's the, it's the attention we give ourselves in the aspects of physical, emotional, mental health, right? The attention we give ourselves in these categories of exercising, eating well, sleeping well, right? Maybe going out in nature, I think is important, right? Going out in nature and also picking up an, up an activity, picking... Sometimes I screw up my talking. I'll get better, guys. I used to chop my teeth in the military really well. I'm just getting used to this YouTube thing. I really want to build the page. So if you guys like what I talk about, really see that this could help you or help others, please subscribe. I would love to have you a part of this, and uh, I really appreciate it. And my good friend, Jesse on Fire, uh, he's one of my favorite YouTubers. That guy says something that I think is really cool. It's like, you know, Halloween. You know, I put the whole thing of candy out there. Um, you know, it's free, right? Just grab one, grab two. You've been a couple times and you like it. Um, you know, just, uh, you know, just grab one at a time and like, uh, don't take the whole thing. You know, people don't like those people, you know, but I don't, I don't really care. I'm just saying, if you like my stuff, it would mean the world to me if you subscribe. So thank you very much. So this is Sandy. Sandy's with us for a while. She trained a lot of, um, she trains uh, seniors in town. She helps senior citizens. She's a big part of the slow pitch league that uh, I'm a part of here. Her husband uh, is an umpire coach and I, I got really good friends with her husband, uh, Al, and uh, just an amazing couple. Uh, Sandy helped me get into the role of training seniors and we had a great time uh, having a course that we had for the seniors at the old gym because it was a much bigger gym. I'm gonna try to post some videos and get good at these um, you know, picture in picture stuff. So when I'm talking, you guys could actually see the gym. So that'll come once I start getting better at all this stuff. And if any of you out there are good on YouTube and know what I'm talking about with, you know, adding videos to these and, and, uh, going on live and all that kind of stuff, uh, please message me. I'd love to, uh, or comment below. I'd love to, uh, you know, get some help from you and, and maybe we could work together, you know, if you want. But anyways, this is, uh, what Sandy wrote here. Um, so this is actually, I'm gonna show you a picture here. Let's see if you can see in the gym where they're training. Uh, it's kind of hard to see, I guess, with the with the blur, but see how they're doing chair training with the seniors there. Um, working on some mo mobility with the shoulders and the back. Um, and there she is there, that was our old gym. So thank you, Sandy, for writing this. Let's, uh, let's talk about it here, let's see what's up. So Santo, and I'm gonna tell you again, guys, it was hard for me to take this in, show emotions. I had to overcome a lot of things. I was addicted to drugs and, you know, these things are finally behind me. I don't want to do those again. So now I'm actually able to feel emotions and, and love and, and even, even sadness. And I love it because emotions are great. That's what makes us who we are. The feelings are amazing, right? We just have to make it not affect us in a negative way. You know, that's how we got to control them. But anyways, so Sandy says, you created, Santo, you created an exclusive environment at Iron Camp Fitness, encouraging everyone to get to know and support each other. 
Through the gym, I met some very special people and I've created lifelong friends. Yeah, like I said earlier, um, last video it was Pauline and she and, and Sandy are very good friends. And, uh, you know, it, and I love hearing that. Thanks. Thanks, Sandy. Um, the most the most significant memory I have is during the senior fitness class. Yeah, I remember those. When you introduce boxing to the seniors, okay. So typically, most trainers, I don't think, would get seniors boxing. But me, being who I am and with my background and my military background, I'm like, you guys, I'm not going to have you guys out there being sitting ducks, okay? My grandma got her purse snatched, and I looked for months for this guy, okay? I was almost going to go to jail to find him, okay? So... When it comes to seniors and I'm going to be training you, get ready to do some boxing. So, okay. So the most significant memory was during the senior fitness class when you introduced boxing to the seniors and encouraged a lady in her 80s to engage in boxing. Yes, I did. 80 years old, you can still throw. You can still throw. She loved it too. I remember. She loved it too. Uh... She engage in boxing exercises. Another thing too, you'll get to know if this is your first video, I'll probably be cutting myself off and re-read re things and stuff. But anyways, hope you don't mind too much. She ends off by saying, what an incredible scenario to watch. Thank you, Santo. I actually got a bunch of that on video. I'm going to go through my computer and try to find them all and try to post them here and some shorts and stuff like that to tell you guys what what uh what she's talking about it was really a special moment i love training seniors i love training everybody man everybody's so unique and it teaches me i love helping people that's one thing i found about out about myself is i get so much out of helping people um i was really in a bad state when i was younger i um you know, was bullied a lot and I allowed self-esteem and body dysmorphia issues. And, and that's what brought me here today to kind of want to help with the mental health aspect of training and really wanted to make you guys love training, love your bodies, love your minds. Sandy, thank you so much for this. ICF client. Sandy was also a trainer too. She says ICF client and trainer. She became a trainer with us as well. Um, she helped with the seniors, like I said. And uh, thank you, Sandy. You're just an amazing person. I can't wait to see you again. Hopefully, we'll see you in the, se in the summer, maybe some ball season. I'll definitely see Al there too. Um, and thank you for that. That really means the world to me. Anyways, guys, that's another episode of Client Testimonials. This was Client Testimonials number four with Sandy. Like I always say, I appreciate you all. You're amazing. Be you. Just improve. If you want to, if you think you need to, if you don't, try to help others. It just makes it so special. And never forget one last thing. Strive without cease. See you later, everybody.